Hi guys, welcome back. This episode I am going to be doing some Fermo window covers for the front windows in the van. Um, I've been looking online at buying some and they do work out quite expensive. I think at the moment Millets have got some on offer. I think about £40 for universal ones. So whether they would fit or not, I don't know. They might fit, they might not fit. So, but me being me, I've decided to have a go at making my own. And as you know, I like to do things on a budget. So, hopefully this might work. From when I've done the insulation, still got some of the thermo, thermal bubble wrap left from the vapour barrier. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut a piece of that for the, put it on the window and get I've still got some four-way stretch carpet left over as well so I'll put that on the back of it give it a bit more strength and a bit more support and then to stick it to the window I bought some of these sucky pads which I originally bought for the curtains on three of the windows um, perfect because these unscrew at the back there you go, you can add stuff to it and then simply screw it back on. There you go. These were on Amazon. I can't remember how many in a pack. This is the one that I bought. And in the comments below, I'll add a link to these. I can't remember the price, but I will add the price here. So that's my plan. Add a load of these everywhere see how this goes I definitely would recommend having some of the covers in the front in the last van we never had any in the summer it was baking hot in the back of the van some will come in and it was really hot um, and then also in the winter keeps it warmer inside keeps the heat in as well so summer keeps the van cool winter keeps the van warmer um, and it also prevent condensation as well over night time so we've got vents and stuff in as well but there's still the chance of getting condensation on the front windows so I definitely would recommend some right have a go now at getting this fitted there we go the main window piece is now cut down to size. Right, and so I've now cut it to size. It's not fully fitted size yet. I've cut around the part of the window. What I'm going to do is I'm going to add the suction cups to it now because then I can fit it better without it moving. There we go, simply. I haven't even cut it into shape yet, to be honest, I don't think I will. Reason being is, if I don't line it up correctly, it's going to be short. Uh, I could spend more time trying to line it up than enjoying my night. So I think I'm going to keep it bigger. Uh, it's doing the job, reflecting sun, so I'm happy with that, I might whack two more in there, but I'm happy with that, so I'll do that now and then I'll get some cut for side windows. There we go, got two cut for the side windows now. Um, Again, I'll literally roughly cut them to size, 
whack a few suction pads on there. Jobs are good in. Yeah, strikes away, no messing. Looking good. What a poo they've turned out. So there we go. Some cheap, quick, budget window covers. And it barely cost anything. I haven't worked it out yet, but I'll put the price here. And this is how much it cost. So I definitely would recommend it perfectly. Fit fine, look good, and easy to store as well. The side windows, they're in the... Um, side pockets and then the main front one I put that underneath our front seat so completely out of the way and it literally takes seconds to put up and to take down so I would highly recommend it and it's a great way of saving a bit of money hope this helps if it has please give us a thumbs up uh, if you haven't already done so please feel free to subscribe for more videos and see you on the next one take care all